I forgot. I forgot in 2018 when we were told there was going to be a Super Mario movie. Um, that was because there was like pre pre production. We had little to no idea about what would be in it. Three years later, in that glorious Bayonetta 3 and Kirby Forgotten Land direct, we got the cast listing for the Mario movie. You can say about that what you will. I really made the rounds about the internet very, very quickly. Um, I am a little unsure about some of the casting choices, but it remains to be seen. I can't really pass off anyone because a lot of these actors are very versatile, so we will see what happens. I think most people are quite concerned about Chris Pratt Mario. I am as well, but we'll wait and see about that. Uh, today, we got our first proper look at the movie. Um, through this poster, which revealed a lot more than most people thought it would. Um, because it's so colourful. Look at it. Now, this poster was released with the news that there's going to be a Nintendo Direct tomorrow, uh, the Super Mario Bros. movie Direct, as well as them showing the trailer live at Comic-Con. Looking at this trailer, I can see that Mario's 3D render is faithful. It's the most realistically rendered Mario we've ever gotten, and I know a lot of people have noticed that. Like, we got a taste for this kind of rendered Mario in Smash Bros. Ultimate. He looks a little bit more human, and in this, he, he fits the theme. He fits the theme in a way that the first animated Sonic didn't, which is what a lot of people are comparing it to. Before I talk about the poster, I want to say that there is a leak, which I can disprove with three points. Um, I've got it on the screen, this is from a McDonald's menu slash promotional item. People believe this to be the face of cinematic Mario. Um, few things, uh, number one, it's weird that this leak only came out after the poster was shown. Isn't it? I mean, what are the chances of that? That's very lucky. We had no idea the poster was going to come out, and as soon as it does, someone claims to know what the cinematic Mario looks like. Um, point number two is that the movie comes out in April now, but that's after one delay, and it was going to come out in December. Why is Mario already on promotional material? And secondly, the first time I saw this leak, it was on a post taking the piss out of it, that anyone can make a leak on Photoshop and it can look as convincing as ever. An example of a very convincing leak is that Rayman leak for Smash Bros. 4, I think it was. That got everyone. But it's only because the creator ended up coming forward that we actually knew it was fake and that probably won't be the case considering this came out in a Discord server this time about this cinematic Mario design. So I don't think it's real. We're going back to the poster. There are floating islands in the sky. That's the first thing I want to get out of the way. Why are there floating islands in the sky? I can't remember a time when there was floating islands. Floating islands are either in Sonic or Skyward Sword and Breath of the Wild too. It's hard to tell what kind of design for Peach's castle and courtyard that they're going for. It looks like they are going completely new uh, for this movie. Obviously the design is a lot like Mario Odyssey, but the design for Peach's castle hardly changes. A lot of the toads look very, very real. A lot of people think that this looks like the Super Nintendo Land in Japan, and it does. They are absolutely right in saying that. There are a lot of Easter eggs. You could look here for absolutely hours, and yes, people have. Looking at all of the little callbacks and tiny Mario references. But a lot of people are holding back. A lot of people don't want to do a massive in-depth analysis of the poster. They would rather wait until the trailer comes out. Um, a lot of people just can't imagine Chris Pratt voicing Mario. This oh, this overshadows everything. This poster could have been a work of art, it could have been the best thing in the world, and it isn't bad. But Chris Pratt is still voicing Mario. and I, <laughs> I, I don't want to say anything, because they've been working on a voice and I'm sure it's going to be amazing. I'm not going to make a video about the trailer, so I just thought I'd say that now. Um, but this poster, it looks... Um, like good news and it gave hope to a lot of people that the movie might actually be faithful and it might actually be what they're looking for 
we only have one Mario movie to compare it to, and I can easily say it's going to be better than that. Um, that's everything I've pretty much got to say. So, I will see you next time. My name is Kobe to Plays for anyone in the future who is not me who is watching this. Um, I should really change that username, but it serves the purpose. Um, bye bye, Saab. <laughs>